Oh, Moist Regrets in the chat. We got girl water. Let's get Moist Regrets in the chat. Thank you, guys. That's her favorite. I don't know if you guys knew this, but Sonic the Hedgehog is is her most favorite. Afternoon advice with X Water and the and the chat. They were the real leaders here. I was just giving a little. I was just giving a little bit of extra piece on top. I'm just giving an extra little bit on top. All right, let's point this guy up a little bit. He's pointing a little low today. He's shagging and bragging, baby. Another big piece of advice, read Some Regrets Sonic Fan Fiction. It's, it's some of the finest literary work I've ever encountered. Fuck. I practice self-care by using my climate incentive rebate on Korean skincare. How much of the rebate on Korean skincare? It's worth it. <laughs> Blair. Blair. That sucked. I didn't hit him with either of those. What's the differences about this Bowser versus the other one? Uh, this one has a completely different set of moves. And this one's a little drier. Was lame. This is what happened when you don't moisturize. Yeah, this Bowser doesn't use Korean skincare. The other one, the other one spent its climate incentive rebate on Korean skincare and it couldn't be happier with the results. You've been struck. You piece of garbage. Why do you have to jump into me, man? Fucking ass. Get out of here. Get out of here. You've been no good to anybody. Get out of here. Nobody wants you around here. Get out of here.
Ah, he didn't stop doing his stuff. That is not a good spot for him to put that. Are you remembering Pooh's advice? The go towards him when he turns into bones? It wasn't bad advice. Listen, it wasn't bad advice. The fight is just very difficult. It's just very difficult. Just do, I think, was his advice. Yeah. I think just do. Man, he perfectly slid into the corner. Annoying. this at all. I couldn't get that. Oh my god, I can't believe he gave me a second bomb right after, dude. What a kind, kind fucking! Are you gonna summon the thing? Nice, right in the corner. No, that's terrible. That's terrible! That spike ruined everything! All right, fast progress today though. Fast progress. And I've already taken damn, I'm gonna end it. Doing way better than yesterday? It's because I followed Jeliski's advice. I, I stopped playing for a day, and my brain made subconscious connections to figure out how to do good at this. <laughs> my neurons are neuroning! You're not following Anita's advice of switching to easy mode? I don't want to. The advice was if you want to. I'm following everyone else's advice of doing what makes me happy. It might not seem like I'm happy, but I promise you I'm having a good time. <laughs> I know I've been cursing a lot and uh, swearing like a sailor every now and then, but uh, this is this is brought this game has brought me great joy. I've had a good time. Wow. 
I'll take the one spike. Sick! Now the other spikes are gone too. That's fantastic news. Can't get that bomb. That's okay. Sometimes it's not meant to be. Sometimes it's just not meant to be. Didn't see the spikes coming from the ground. Uh-oh, spaghetti. So you. Meow. Oh my God. Mr. Streamer X Water, sir. Have you considered trying going outside and touching some grass? You might get a much needed mental break to help clear this. Wee. There's no grass. It's a winter fucking hellscape outside. There is no grass to be touched. Oh, just touch the hellscape then. I don't want you. It's cold. Uh, I've had zero hot drinks today. Honestly, I could use some tea. I wouldn't mind some tea. Maybe we'll take a tea break. Maybe we'll take a tea making break in a little, a little while. Ah. Or you could touch some grass with your lungs. I, I don't get it. Could you please explain what you could possibly mean by that? I don't get it. Oh, the blueberry yum yum. Oh, the sticky icky. The wacky tobacky. Shit. Oh. Then I get a little bit of blueberry yum yum. Start a prairie fire. The joke was too high, he missed it. Nice, early double. An early double from the man, jeez. Give me a bomb? Dang. I dropped it instead of throwing it. Sad days. There was nowhere else real. Oh, I guess I could have jumped and gone left. Uh, yeah, I could have jumped and gone left. Hard boss is hard. Hard boss is hard.
I should change my name to Poo Water. Are you even trying anymore? Damn it, the fucking getting hit by the hammer is extra, extra lame. Bye. I'm dead. That was a that was a trap. That was a trap. It literally just forced me into the corner and then bombarded it. Chad has run out of jokes. Time to move on. Oh, yeah, I mean, Chad, you, listen, you guys have been, you guys have been really scraping the bottom of the barrel with the jokes. You guys have been a little bit bottom of the barrel, specifically this, this first hour of the stream. You guys have been finding the lowest hanging fruit. Get a ladder. Get some of that high up fruit, guys. Collaborate, you know, work, work it out. Work on your material. I, like, I knew that the dropping ball was coming. I just didn't really have a plan or idea on how to better deal with it. And my placement of my spikes is leaving me in a real bad position to deal with those hammers. <laughs> Remember when X-Water changed the Kindra's name to Turd? Off of chat's suggestion, okay? I did that because of you guys. Specifically, chatter meme P21. The ground looks really tough after he destroys it. I bet Tiger Woods wouldn't have a problem. Yeah, well, why don't you go watch Tiger Woods play game Grand Poo World 3, okay? Maybe Tiger Woods will be your new dad. Yeah. Oh, thank you. I would love it if you got rid of the spikes. I somehow got hit still. You should put Tiger Woods of Grand Poo World 3 in your title. If I didn't think, if I thought it to be true, I would. I'm the Tiger Woods of damageless 3D Mario challenges. Okay, I'll take that. I'm the Tiger Woods of damageless 3D Mario challenges. I don't think I've, I've been, I think I can safely say that. I did, I saw the meme you posted, the Tiger Woods one. I saw the, <laughs> the fucking. What happens when Pi takes your challenge? Give him nine months and he'll be on the same level that I'm on. But it's gonna take a while. It's gonna take him a while to get there. You guys saw it. You guys saw how long it took to do. He's not gonna get there quickly. I don't doubt Pi's gaming ability. I just know how insanely difficult that challenge is. did the extra bounce there. I heard the jump noise, but I still died. 
I know the world record holder of the 602, and it's still an 18-hour run. A casual, inexperienced, or, like, a casual speedrunner who, like, kind of knows strats for each games for 602 is going to have a 28 or so hour run. With the perfect run, when I did when I did that, I was able to specifically do the easiest parts of the game, right? I was able to say, "Oh, this level has a high risk of damage. I shan't be I shan't be attempting it because I could just do this one." Uh, that option is not going to be available for Pi when he does his. So that's going to increase. Like it's going to be exponentially harder than what I did exponentially. I look forward to watching his journey. I look forward to it. One spike just smack dab in the middle. Bomb check? Any bombs? Bombs? Fuck, this is a bad set. See ya! Ah, oh, I didn't dodge the hammer. I, I hide in the corner because a lot of the times he puts a spike up right away. I can't wait for Pi to field all the is this damage questions from chat. Oh my god, yeah. Like, remember how we returned to Super Mario Sunshine to do the 100% damage list and how it took an extra, like, several months? Just for sun dude, watching Pi learn sunshine damage list is gonna be content, dude. That's gonna be content. And he hates that game. I hope he's ready to play it more than any of the other ones. <laughs> At least that game doesn't have any RNG bullshit that leads to damage. Completing Sunshine 100% more than once is going to be a, such a huge challenge in itself. Wow, really fucking pinched me there, didn't you, Bowser? Really trapped me there. You cleared the pachinko level without dying? 
also kind of tough. Is there a clip of you taking damage towards the ends of Sunshine, or am I making that up? Oh, there was a lot of them. There was a lot of them. I frequently took damage towards the end of Super Mario Sunshine. There was a me it was a meme for a while that I would take damage on Shine 47 every time, because the Chucksters. I can't wait to see how Pi deals with the Chucksters, dude. I can't wait to see how he deals with that one. Yeah, but Chester. Isn't Bowser Water RNG too? Yes. Yes, it is. It, it absolutely is. You're right. Bowser water is RNG. There is no known way on my end of making the Bowser, the Bowser fight at the end of Super Mario Sunshine consistently safe. I bet it exists. I never found it. I also didn't use, um, rocket storage at all maybe rocket storage uh will make that you know will allow for some sort of buffoonery to increase your your chances odds lower the difficulty Good. I don't like the positioning of these. Ah, he went one more bounce than I anticipated. Okay, good. Wow. 
Yo, phase three and I'm still big? I was about to say, not for long. That bomb was stressing me out. Fucking asshole. That's eight. I somehow need another bomb. No! <sighs> good attempt, good attempt. I don't know if that second one hit him. It didn't seem like it did. Oh shit, I knew he was gonna go that way. I don't know why I didn't jump sooner. He was about to clear them, too. No! Why did I fucking press the down button, man? This is not at all what I intended to do. back. I was not clutch enough to double up on the hits there. No more spikes, and here they are. I know. I know. I know, guys. I know I jinxed it. I know. I know. You don't have to say it. I know. Wow. Wow. Real clutch dodges for a second there. What time gap do you usually do between breakfast and lunch? I usually do a four to five hour gap. Uh, I don't have a good enough routine to have a set gap between breakfast and lunch. Thank you. 
This is, a, this is a bad attempt. I, there was some terrible misplays I've had. Wow. Terrible spot for double spikes. Terrible, terrible spot. If I would have had the foresight to stay closer, I just know I didn't have the space. Man, I ran into the side of the spike. That was misplay. That was a skill issue. Okay, okay, okay. Ah, I shouldn't have jumped. That was uh, also a skill issue. Also a big skill issue. Big, big skill issue. Big, big boog bug. Big, big. Bug, bug, big. The spike in the corner stopped me from getting any safer against that particular... Bro, he... Oh, I was expecting him to jump into the air sooner than that. I did hit him with the bomb. That does delay him, but I thought he'd be up there sooner. bad spot.
Really bad spot for the spikes. The fact that they weren't next to each other really hurt things there. Beautiful. Not beautiful. Oh, the bomb. I thought I was safe there. The hardest boss fight you've ever played? No, I think the previous boss fight in this game was harder. We've had an eight uh, tie with the PB, Demoth. We've tied the PB today. Definitely not the hardest boss fight I've ever played, but it's it's incredibly difficult. And it is also very fun. You can get rid of the spikes whenever you want, and nobody would be upset if, uh, about it. There you go. I have so many of those mistakes where I accidentally drop the bomb and blow myself up a little bit. It's very unfortunate. Did he just really jump back and forth? I hate when he does that. Fuck! Okay, I'm saving the corner. Baby in the corner. <sighs> oh, this is so bad. Oh my god, I can't believe I made it past that particular group of fucking Dying at the bombs from the sky is the worst. It is the worst death. It's random. They don't seek you. It's just random. Sometimes you can just hide in the corner and none of them will ever even approach you.
Okay, it's not good, but it's not good. Bomb, no. All right, that's the next phase again. Oh, this is fucking ass. This is so goddamn bad. Oh, saving that first bomb by up throwing it twice was insane. But there's just so when the spike is in the middle, you just lose, dude. Uh, Alicia, thank you so so much for four years. Thank you so so much. I'm gonna shabooboo that one. Early damage is a no-no. Early damage is a no-no. I'm starting to get to the point where like, if I take a damage before four hits, I feel like the attempt is dead. I feel in, in, in my soul that this is gonna just be a lot better if I can approach phase three while still big. And I know that I can. I know I have the skills for it. I've done it. It's just so hard. All right, we'll keep it. It's phase two. I'll keep an attempt at phase two. Practice of phase two is honestly not bad. Getting some more practice for phase two is not bad. Please, Spike. Okay, Spike in the corner. I just don't... I get... No, I guess I could have hit on the right side of the platform. It's so hard because his movement speed in Phase 3 for his bounces feels different. Like, it's like he slowed down because of the gaps. I think if he's phase three doing a bounce from the wall, I think that's just a sign that I need to, uh, I need to stay towards him on the edge of the platform. I work today, so subbing and running, no worries. We'll see you around, dude. Good enough. So bad, such a bad spot.
reset that one. Boink, boink. Hate that, hate that. Uh, I wish he didn't spawn right or stop right next to me. I would have been able to do something. Thanks, short fused. We're about an hour deep on attempts today. We've had a, an eight good chunk of phase threes. We gooping the baby today? Yeah, I'm going to have to goop the baby later. bombs spawn dude like they forced me into the corner without having chosen to go right instead of left like that was that was like a pick a door death right there that one i i just don't i just do not see a way that i could have reacted that didn't involve me dying there i, I just can't see it i just can't see it
Bye. That one... That one I did peek at chat while he was leaving, and that was a mistake. I peeked at chat, I read, imagine not having godlike reflexes, and then I got hit by a bomb without even trying to move. It was honestly pretty ironic. Oh, he's in the next phase. I didn't realize. Oh, that was weird. I had to I sh I had to have run right after there. I thought I was going to be able to jump and dodge the explosion, but I was afraid of running right because if every time I run to a fucking corner, I just die. I get pinched into a corner and I die. So I feel like running to the corner is stupid. Oh, I'm so glad he jumped into that there. That was awesome. Please clear the spikes. <laughs> Donk. Sorry, Manic T. I was just checking my Twitter DMs and my email. I'm trying to get a key, an early access key for Pal World, aka Pokemon with Guns. 
but I haven't gotten a reply yet. I really want to play that. It's out on Game Pass? I thought you needed, uh, I thought it came out on Friday. I thought it was uh, creators getting early access. Yeah, not early access like an early access game, but like I thought creators were getting like into the game three days before everyone else kind of thing. And people with like beta passes and stuff like that or whatever, however they're running it. To be fair, I haven't really looked too deeply into it. I knew that I was going to be stuck doing this for a while today, so I figured start here that was dumb That was dumb. Bro, can you give me a cut me a cut me a cut me a break? Give me a break of that Kit Kat bar. Can you give me off a piece of that Kit Kat bar? I do want to play the new Prince of Persia. Um, I haven't tried too hard to find a key. I, I want to get a key for it. I want to see if Ubisoft will send me a key because obviously, like, why wouldn't they, right? Uh, I got to reach out to someone there. Because <laughs> why wouldn't they, right? Mm, smug ass X water. <laughs> Atari reached out to me earlier uh, this week. They have a game, Mr. Run and Jump. It was in game uh, Stasher Trash a while ago. I was like, wow, I did not expect to receive a DM from Atari. Chambo was playing that. Did it look cool? I'm gonna put it, I'm gonna put it in Game Wave at some point. I thought it looked like a fun game. Gameplay looks good. Mr. Streamer X Water, sir, are you winning, son? Moist fancy weed. Fancy weed? Uh, no, not yet, but I will. Shouldn't have gone over there. Let's 
the fuck? That's eight hits. Oh my god, please just be- Oh, the fucking spike right there. You dildo! Ah. Gonna take the death on this one. Preemptive dig animation was funny. He fell down as a pile of bones, I know. I could have finessed that the tiniest little bit, but it was not going to be easy. That's ass. That's ass. That's ass. Follow visual or sound cues for the cannonballs? A little of both. A little of both. When he hammers, when he... That's why I try not to jump with hammers, but when you're stuck between spikes, you kind of don't have a choice. Well, you do, but it's just hard. Spikes. Why did I jump? I don't know why I jumped. My guess is that it's nine hits to kill. My guess is that it's nine.
terrible spots. Terrible spots. Can this be not spin jumped on? The spikes you can't spin jump on, no. The Bowser you can spin jump on. He's gonna hammer, he's gonna stomp. After the stomp, he's gonna long jump and he's gonna spike. I'm actually learning some of the opening patterns and I hate that. That's not great, but it's not the... Huh? Fuck. I wanted to hit him before he stomped to make the fire delayed. That was another eight. That was another eight. Fucking so dope right there. Threaded the needle, baby. Thank <laughs> you. 
I'm glad he jumped into the explosion. That was nice of him. Shit, my brain did not do the right operation there. <sighs> Hello from Finland. What's up? From Canada. No use brain. Me no use brain. DVD cornered me on that one. Jumping bomb? No. Jumping bomb? Okay. Hammers?
See ya. Oh my god, two? Terrible spot for a spike. How do I know if this is the final boss? I, I know. jumped into it. That was not what I wanted. I was just trying to delay the bomb explosion. That sucked ass, dude. That sucked major ass. Not a great spot. Not a great spot! Shouldn't have jumped. That's a terrible spot for it. I guess I gotta not go towards the bomb when I throw it. Opposite corners is the intended place where I want the spikes. Sometimes I just don't get there in time. I forgot I was phase one. I'm just gonna take the death. Reset it.
Any sneak peeks into what's making it into the next game wave? I've already got the roster selected. Um, you get your sneak peeks next week. You can get them next week. Any of your games make it in? Uh, not this week, I don't think. Have I been to a GDQ in person before? I went to a lot of them. Uh, from 2016 to 2020, I went to like five or six between AGDQ and SGDQ. I love GDQ. I haven't been in a while. I haven't been since 2020. Um, my speed running has shifted a lot. For, uh, my, my streaming has shifted a lot from speed running type stuff. And I've just, like, kind of entered a new phase of life. <clears throat> Where I don't... But with the, with the trips that I take every year, I don't have, like, another two weeks to... To give to GDQ each year. I do want to go at least, like, for a short period of time in the future. Like, for a future GDQ. I would love to go as... Like, for, for a weekend kind of deal. Didn't Pooh say he's planning to be done with GDQ attendance so he can focus more on his own events? Yeah, Pooh's, Pooh's busy as fuck, dude. With his own events and everything? I don't know what he said, but I wouldn't be surprised if... If he does not have the time to attend GDQs in the same capacity. At this point, if I'm not, like, in a GDQ, I'm probably not going to commit to going for the full week. Fucking glorious. Did you see that? That double hit? And then I just get hit like that? Yeah, I did main phase of life, so I'm in battle. I'm in combat phase right now. Uh, when I went, I was on the couch slash announcing a couple of times. I announced uh, a Mario Maker relay. I was on the couch for Pooh's Dram World run. I've never been a runner in a GDQ, though. Pooh said he wouldn't compete due to his own events and not wanting to miss his son growing up. Yeah, it's very fair. I feel like... The big difference for me is I've have, I have a long-term girlfriend now who isn't as into the hobby of streaming gaming as I am, right? So... If I'm going to take a week vacation, she's not really going to want to... She, I'm sure she would be happy to join me for, for it, but like, I'm sure she would have a much better time if her and I took a trip together to some location where both of us could have a good time doing something we both like really enjoy. Um... Yeah, not to say I'll never go to a GDQ or attend, but it's not a huge priority for me at this point. Coming to weddings of his online friends? Yeah, that, honestly though, I've... In the last three years, I think I've been to like fucking 10 to 14 weddings and there's six this year. I've already been to one this year, there's five more. It's a lot of weddings this year. Uh. Ah! 
You shoot me an invite, Kevo. If you're, if you're saying what I think you're saying, you're shooting me an invite. I'll do my best to make it. I can't guarantee anything right now, but I'll do my best to make it. I also love going to weddings. Don't get me wrong. I do love going to weddings. It definitely robs a lot of your weekends in the summer, but I say that as if you're not, you know, raw, like you get to go have a sick time at a sweet party with a bunch of people that you know and enjoy and like and love. So it's not a bad thing at all. But it does end up being like, oh man, that's like six weddings I've been, that's like half of my summer that has gone to just weddings now. Nice, I'm so glad he jumped into that for me. Thank you. You're my good boy, Bowser. You're my good boy. Nice, get out of here. Weddings are expensive, yeah. Not to mention I've been in a couple of weddings, like my brother got married last year. So it's a wedding and a, and a bachelor party. Bomb fell down the hole. Bomb in the hole. Amazing. Spike in the middle. Amazing. Amazing. I'll go kill myself now. Yeah, no, my um my my brother, we did a bachelor party for my brother last year. I'm standing in one of my best friend's weddings this year, so I'll be going to another bachelor party this year. Oh, poor, poor guy he has to go have all this fun with his friends. But yeah, you know what I mean? Like GDQ is taking a second place to, to a lot of these like big major life events type deal. So glad to be done paying for a wedding. I bet. He jumped one more than I expected. Bachelor parties are pricey? Yeah. They are. They ain't cheap. I'm gonna need to pull in some serious sponsor gigs this spring. I'm too far to get that bomb. It's not happening. Snipe! Idiot! These are, these are probably the worst placed spikes that I could have had. <laughs> Truly terrible. <clears throat> oh! Spike in the corner? Damn it. Yo, thanks, Athena. Your bachelor party will probably be just playing Mario Kart or something. <clears throat> I think when I do a bachelor party, I'm just gonna try to rent out a cottage for a weekend. Just a nice nearby cottage. Nothing like too crazy expensive. Um, Cause for me, I don't really care where I'm at as long as I got my homies with me, you know what I mean? As long as I got my people with me, I'm happy. Spin jumping off explosions is not safe, no. 
there's a chance that spin jumping off an explosion kills you. Sounds like an awesome time, Woodsy. You get rid of those. <laughs> wow. He's going to bring more spikes soon. Called it. Mario and I died at the tw I ah. Why not? Why wouldn't the people working at McDonald's be happy about you bought Imagine being a fast food kitchen chef and some people come up and go, I have 200 McNuggets. Imagine being that employee, dude, you wouldn't be happy. Yeah, it's, it's money for the business, not for the employees making Mick minimum wage. <laughs> hey, there's nothing wrong with doing it, Nightfall. There's nothing wrong with doing it. You know, you're allowed to go there. That's why they're there, to give you the nuggies that you order. That's their job, to make you the food that you, you, want, you want them to make you. But it's also understandable that if someone walks into your place of business and is like, Ugh, can I get an absurdly large order that's way out of the normal compared to what people usually get here? Totally reasonable for them to be pissed off, too. Like, they'll do it. They're just not going to be happy about it, right? They're going to go home from work that day and you're going to be like, can't believe these assholes who came into the store today. You're never going to believe what these fucking assholes did. <laughs> Some idiots ordered 200 burgers through the drive-thru at McDonald's once. We were like, come into the store, idiots. If 
your order is more than can be cooked at the same time, they will not be happy. Yeah. If your order is more than the amount of nuggets they already have made, or burgers or chicken or whatever, they're gonna be a little, they're gonna, they're gonna be a little annoyed. Oh. I've sat in the drive-thru while the person before me having ordered like six bags of fast food, which obviously took ages to prepare. Usually if somebody has an absurdly large order, the employees will just say, pull up to the parking spot and we will give you your food when it's ready. Uh, but we got people in the line that we can serve right now. A box of 20 nuggets in Canada is like 16 bucks. I don't ever buy nuggets in Canada. I never buy chicken nuggets in Canada because it's highway robbery. I I could spend $16 on a like three kilogram pack of ch delicious, better quality than McDonald's nuggies chicken tendies from, from fucking Costco. The Eerie Meats, love those nuggies. Inflation is out of control! I say it like I'm joking, but it's actually really, 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 really bad times right now. <laughs> I'm sure, I'm sure the majority of us who buy groceries can agree. Sounds like the liberal agenda. <laughs> At least millennials aren't being blamed for it anymore. Yeah, now it's now it's the lazy Gen Z. But honestly, I see so many like dumb posts from like people who are millennials now being like fucking Gen Z. It's so annoying. Why, how could they do this? Every generation sucks. Thanks for coming to my TED talk. Uh, here's my take. People are not all that different regardless of which generation they're in. They live in the circumstances of their, of their world. And anytime an older generation complains about a younger generation, it's like, who fucking raised them? This is on you, old man. That was a nice little double hit. I like that a lot. Can we please get a spike clear? Oh, oh that's Garbaglo. I don't raise anyone. Don't put that on me. You raise me up every day. I be in here. Do you have White Castle in Canada? No. And honestly, 
We're not really missing out. White Castle is mid AF. I'd say lower mid, honestly. Fast Eddies? Never even heard of Fast Eddies. Aw, oh, fast ditties, nuts to your face. Don't don't hit me with any 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 anything like this right now. I can't handle it. I'm suffering too much trauma from this boss fight. Space jump, thanks for the prime. Firehouse subs is 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 overpriced. It's not a bad sub. It's just expensive. It's just overpriced. It's like a classic. Um, it's like a classic uh, Five Guys situation. It's a perfectly a good tasting burger. It's just overpriced for what you're getting. I like Jimmy John's a lot. When I go to America, I like to get Jimmy John's. I'm a big fan of Jimothy Johnnings. Uh, it's gonna be in the gap. That's actually not the worst. It's not incredible, but it's not the worst. I wanted to save the bomb so badly. As a BK chicken enjoyer, how does Popeye's? Oh, Popeye's chicken sandwich is, is the best of the fast food chicken sandwiches I've had. The Burger King chicken sandwich is purely about the economics of it. It's purely about the economics of it. Two for five. Meanwhile, Popeyes, you're spending like nine bucks on a single one. Delayed because I wanted the spike over there and I didn't really register in my head that the falling evil balls were on their way. Fuck, I needed to throw that upwards. The hot honey McCrispy from McDonald's is real good too. I don't anytime Burger King, McDonald's, when like anytime they put out these like new fancier sandwiches, I'll I'll do it. I'm going to McDonald's, I want my Big Mac. I'm like a McDonald's boomer. If I'm going to McDonald's, I want my Big Mac. Stop trying to be, stop trying to be something you're not McDonald's. Uh, honey McCrisp. Get out of here, McDonald's. You've seen me drunk at 3 a.m. downtown in the, in the worst of days. And you fed me in those moments. Don't pretend like you're some sophisticated restaurant with anything to, to offer beyond the basic needs of human sustenance. Okay, I don't go to McDonald's because I'm looking for delicious flavor. I'm going there because I want my slop. Baby goes to McDonald's for his slop. Thank you for clearing those out. They were really bad.
is good, but I usually get a McDouble. I usually just, yeah, I'm, I'm a Burger King double, uh, original chicken sandwich guy right now. A McDonald, a McDouble at McDonald's right now, I think is like a little over like 3.30ish. A two original chicken sandwiches is five bucks. 2.50 a, a chicky sandwich and they're bigger. And honestly, I, I'm not saying they're the best sandwich, but I like them. I like them. It's Whopper Wednesday. Whopper Wednesday isn't even that good of a deal anymore, man. I watched in the last three years. I like every every day I walked past the Burger King because it was like close to where I was living. And I watch as the sign, the number of, of, of the price for Whopper Wednesday goes up 20 cents every month. Just continually rising. It never slows down. It never slows down. It's just always going up. Crazy. It's crazy, guys. But I can't take it anymore. Yeah, I got her good. Bomb? Bomb? No, more spikes. Cool. The dollar menu isn't what it used to be. You can't even call it a dollar menu anymore. They call it a value menu, and I'm like, biggest fucking lie I ever heard. Yeah, I, I pretty much only get fast food with a coupon, and, or, or uh, if they're having like a sweet limited time deal. Most of the McDonald's near me do actually do Big Mac Wednesdays to comp to like steal co uh, business from Burger King. So it's like a buck less and you get a Big Mac meal instead of a Whopper meal. And I'll play that game. I'll play that game. What's worse, value meal fast food or fun-sized candy bars? Ah, oh, I didn't even hit him, dude. I was finessing out of my mind for that bomb throw. I shouldn't have done that. I wasted a bomb there. on in and out I love in and out I get in and out all the time when I'm in America when I'm around it huge fan the fries are shit I never get the fries at in and out they're actually dog shit I just get the I just get a, a double double animal style and I'm out of there base you work at has a stupid subway as the only food option and you can't get a lunch there for less than $20 robbery yeah that was the university uh it was similar the food court they had a they had a couple like food court things and then a subway and there was another subway that was like a three minute walk off campus and I was I would always go off campus because the one that was on campus didn't do five dollar footlongs but the other one did so I would always just walk to the other one I'm gonna take a death here. 
I want a full meal when I go to fast food and their fries are so bad I don't care to go. Very fair. Fair and valid. I can't fault you for that. For me, I'm totally cool just getting a good a good burger or two. I'm totally fine. If I'm like extra hungry, I pick up two burgers. If I'm a little hungry, I get one. I'm totally happy with that. So many close calls right there. Wow! Fuck me! What's up, Coda? I keep forgetting in phase one he doesn't jump. I'm having the opposite problem I had yesterday where now I'm just always assuming he's gonna jump. Get that. Oh, there we go. Nice. I wanted the bomb. I couldn't have it. Ah. That was just a. Uh bad bomb management on my end. I also am feeling the hunger from all this food conversation. I definitely want to get some food in me. Just trying to decide what. Can always get some Olive Garden. It's like you're trying to upset me. Mayorios with freshly grated cheese is an option now. That's true. Could make some hobo pizzas. He took a lot of bounces there. 
a lot more than the usual number of bounces. Ah, you heard the sound effect of the jump before I got hit. It was just a, like a frame too late. leaving. Spike in the corner. That's the fucking worst. Oh my fucking god. Please bomb. I just, I could still die. Something could still kill me. <gasps> Am I gonna chase him in an airship chase? What the fuck is this? Oh no. If I die here, do I not have a checkpoint? You can't do this to me, Barb. No, 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 no. Hitting the boat does minimal damage. Oh my god, I'm so nervous. I would rather take minimal damage with more health. Oh my god. Oh my god. Can I press R to turn the radio and uh, put hot drinks back on though? I'd love, I'd love to complete, to complete the game to hot drinks!
I do it? Did I win? Please tell me I win. You look in the mirror and see the planet explode. Oh my God. It was as if, I don't, oh shit. I didn't need to read it. <laughs> At this speed, you should reach the nearest star in about 6,000 years. Mario's and Spice. You killed all those people, D. Whatever. I did it! Finally! I cannot thank you enough for your years of help from the bottom of my heart. Thank you. Aww. The staff! Look at all these gamers. Oh, we got a scam train along with the victory. Let's go. Inspired by Chump Team, Takemoto, G Breeze, Just Cook, Morsel, Panga, and Freakin' Ika. Shout outs to Stu. Uh, Rot Siv and DeWild Grim. Are the, that, um, is that podium for uh, Grand Pool World 2 at the moment? Here we go. We got all the... All the credits. Aw, oh, are these all the... These all the people who are in the portraits? These all the portrait gamers? Scam time. Wee! Wee! Oh my god, I'm so happy. It took so much work. It took so much work. Was I in there? Oh, I didn't even see that! Was I in there? I was... I collected the coins too fast. That's amazing. It's the guy. That's so cool. Oh my god, I'm in the credits. Mr. Streamer X Water, sir. That's Did the you coolest. Mean to kill everyone? You. Thanks, Barb. Murder. Moist it. Wee. Last but not least, my wife and my two girls, I love you more than tiles can say. Ah! I can't believe I'm in the credits. Wait, there was a fucking super missile the whole time? I could have had a charge up missile? Ah! Coffee, decaf, hot tea. And hot chocolate, those are the hot drinks that you serve. So get set hot cups come in two sizes, small and large are filled as the need arises. <sighs> it feels so good. It feels so good to have won. Oh. <laughs> Credits roll of every game. It's always the best part. I did have a checkpoint at the ship battle. I would have been fine. Okay, good. Thanks for the money. Part of the text you missed before the credits, as if millions of Yoshis cried out <laughs> and were suddenly silenced. You rejoice. <laughs> It was nine hits. Took nine hits. That medley is amazing. Da 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 da. Hey, and the nine gifted as well. Yo, thank you to everybody for the celebratory gifters. Uh, Vega with the nine gifted, Sparkling Parfait with the 500 biddies, Truck and Player X, Turg and Patrick Baton with the 100 scam time biddies, Turg with the fiver, Whip with the fiver, Nightfall with the gifter. Thank you all very, very much. I appreciate it greatly, guys. If I want to see what? Uh... Oh, the... my name in the credits. Yeah, the clip will be nice. Bravo, Moist, bravo. 
Walker, thank you for the gift or two. Um, I believe Barb said that in 1.1, this will save as an exit. Oh, okay. So this is, now I'm just, now I just, the, now that the medley's over, there's nothing else. I'm safe to reset slash turn off. Slash start select. Nice target. For this version, this is the end. Okay. So yeah, if I go back in, I'm back at the Bowser fight, right? Yeah. The lack of an exit is why you missed the secret thing in the final level. Yeah. Um. The big long bridge. Someone told me already with the big long bridge, if I had finished the gates of fire first, I would have been able to skip all the cape, right? That's what it would have done. It would have skipped all the cape. I think I remember that being... There's a couple other things in there, too. Oh, okay. There's more to it. Do you want to know? Um, yeah. I feel like I've earned it, right? I feel like I've earned it. There's no way for me to get back there, so... Do I have the right amount of exits, though? Is, is there not one more exit? I could have sworn I saw 42 on, like, Pooh's save screen between runs. There's another portrait of Pooh and a secret pipe that skips the cape, and then there's Corn Dilly. Yeah, that's where Pooh's picture is at, as well as a broken Corn Dilly. Oh, okay. So, I have no more content to, that, I, that I need to do. They're counting the last... Oh, okay. Okay, I see. They're counting the... that as a credit. I get it. I get it. Except hard mode. Yeah, there's still hard mode. I'm not... I'm not currently um, certain on if I'm going to attempt hard mode. I'm not certain on if I'm going to attempt hard mode, but... We'll, we'll address that. We'll address that tomorrow. A uh, bonus for completing hard mode. I bet that's why Pooh's playing as Walter Luigi. Yeah. Can we have a celebratory hot drinks, please? Here you go. What better way to celebrate than with some hot drinks? Let's do it. Soki, thank you for the hundo biddies. There could be Iron Mon as a bonus. No, we're not Iron Moning today. Uh, we'll probably... We'll do something. I don't know what yet. We'll do something. One at a time? I missed it. Can you do it again? You can watch the VOD. Hype train Little complete. Bits. Level three. Let's go. I got another one of those stupid Little disco bits. ball emotes. What did I get? I got hype delight. I got uh, hype GG eyes. And I got hype elf. Me, me, me. 
I've collected all of the level 5 emotes. Is all of the levels in hard mode also in random order? I think it is. Yeah. Let Plinko pick. I'm gonna get myself uh, a pizza in the oven first. And I'm gonna prepare myself a hot drink. I'm going to bring you guys with me. You can come along. This guy should connect in a second. 